Hi everyone, in today's video we are going to tackle four spots that have just become clutter magnets in my home. I hope that it's an encouragement to you, so let's get started. My name's Emily and this is Queen of the Household. So this first space is a drawer in our kitchen and honestly it felt like the Mary Poppins bag. Like I was just pulling out so much stuff from this drawer and I was like is there anything that does not fit in here? It just kept coming and coming. But I took everything out and sorted through it, kept what needed to be kept and then only put back the items that actually had to be in that space. Next is my dirty little secret. This is our closet of shame in our basement. I think probably everyone has one and y'all, I'm sharing it with you. So this just has old clothes that my kids have outgrown, suitcases we no longer use, paperwork, baby stuff, all kinds of just stuff that has just been taking up space in this closet. It's so annoying every time I open the door and I just knew I needed to tackle it. So. Here I am um, with my kids, you know, a lot of times I can't have them, you know, off doing something. I'm a mom and so I'm right here and they're right with me as I'm tackling all of this stuff and I think that it's good because it shows an example to them about decluttering and organizing our spaces and just um, taking care of our homes. So they help me, it does take a little longer, but that's okay. So we're gonna just take everything out of here and then I'll share with you what I do with the stuff that's left. So we were able to give away our playpen and our high chair and also a crib that isn't even shown here. But we know some people who are having babies and we are happy to give them to someone that will use them instead of them just staying in our closet. I was able to sell these suitcases on Facebook Marketplace and then also this little rocking chair. And then these clothes I'm donating. They're not good enough to sell, but they're still usable. And then I had a couple of other things, this music stand and just some other random things that I'm gonna be donating to Goodwill. And then I also have this basket with some clothes and shoes that I'm gonna try and sell from Once Upon a Child. And if they don't take it, then I'll just donate it. And I put them right in my vehicle so that I would make sure that I get those taken to where they need to go. And then I also had a trash bag. So there was just some stuff that just needed to be thrown away. And so that's what I did with that. Next up is our homeschool space. So we're done with school for the year and it had just kind of become a mess. 
and my kids still use a lot of these items but some of the things they need to be gotten rid of and just kind of pared down and decluttered so I went ahead and cleared it all out and I ended up also spray painting this shelf so that it is black and I feel like it just kind of blends in better in this corner and I only left the things that we absolutely will use this summer and then I'll redo it again in the fall when school starts again. But I truly believe that you don't have to spend a lot of money to organize your space. As long as you take out the items that are no longer serving you or that just are getting in your way and making things complicated, clearing off the space and then only put back the items that you actually use you don't have to spend a bunch of money on fancy containers and things like that so i'm basically just using what i have and cleaning up the space and just getting a whole new look and a whole new feel for each of these places in my home Last up is under our bathroom sink and it wasn't too bad but it just had collected a few items that didn't need to be in there in our toy situation. Our kids had taken the toys outside and it had gotten kind of dirty with grass on it and then our toilet paper was sitting on top of the toys. So I just cleaned everything out and resituated it all and it looks so much better and it's much more functional. I already had these little tubs on the side that were working quite well so I left those all the same. But the other stuff just got taken out and wiped down and then put back in an orderly fashion. 